what we're greeted with again. I came prepared this time though, y'all. shame that we can't just come out here and get started with our fishing day because we got to pick up after all the disgusting people that come out here and think this is their trash can. I'm sorry for like two days in a row bringing like negative stuff to the channel but I do think it's worth mentioning the fact that you got disgusting people out here that just completely trash our resource. Uh, just you can leave it there for right now. Come make your campfire, trash the place up. It'll be amazing. Brand new leader. Yeah, I see it. You, you want to know, like, I, I just told the audience that I hate the fact that I'm bringing something negative, but I, I do think it needs, it's, it warrants to be talked about. People being like this, but the crazy thing is there's a trash can literally right there that they can walk to. That's how lazy this special breed of fisherman is. So just what I'm trying to do is clean up my fishing area. So again, people who aren't from Texas don't have to uh, have this perception of you guys are nasty. Like Texas YouTubers, stay away from the bank. Otherwise, your videos are just going to be filled with litter. I mean, we can't even go to a marsh system without it being filled with litter as well. You always see trash lining the bank. Just no pride whatsoever. Four minutes of time cleaning up the immediate area. That's all it takes. I mean, if everybody would come out here and then just spend four minutes of their time, I mean, together we could all make a, like put a real big dent in the laziness of others. That is it. Just worked my way back to this trash can. It's that simple. One bag full of trash.
Now we've got a clean fishing area right over there to, uh, that looks pretty presentable. So if y'all do go over to my fishing channel, you're definitely going to be able to see uh, a complete difference. Stepping out of the truck, filming in my immediate area, no trash in the water anymore. Awesome. What's that? Oh yeah. Probably a mullet is what it looks like. Uh, that's a hard head. Yeah. Okay, y'all, that's going to do it for this video. Very simple. Hopefully, the message, you know, comes across as being well received. I don't do this to try to be negative but I just I honestly think like I can look off in the distance and right over here is a cigarette wrapper and we got some trash bags over there we got some across the way over here I mean there's just litter everywhere it's so disgusting if we all pitch in as I said earlier we could definitely put a big dent in keeping our resource clean Texas City has spent, I'm pretty sure, an absurd amount of money putting all these trash cans up and down the dike that people are just so lazy. It, it, gets, it gets me so upset. Like right over here floating down the waterway. This is what happens. They leave their trash unsecured. It makes its way into the water. The tide comes in. The ships come through. It pushes a big wake. It flushes all these rocks out. And then there goes a bottle right there floating down. If I could get that and reach it, I would, but yeah. All right, I'm upset. Uh, hopefully the fishing is going to be good today so I can get out of this mood. It just sucks having to come here. That's why you don't come to the Texas City Dyke because it's just loaded with trash. This is what you're greeted with. This one was orange on the inside. What is that? That's all his guts. All right, that's going to do it. Thank you again so much for watching. I just left this one raw and uncut because it deserves its day uh, with your eyes and ears. So thank you for watching. Off the water, we've got over 50-something episodes. I've been really doing my best to continuously drop that daily content. So for all of y'all that have tagged along thus far, thank you so much. I really really from the bottom of my heart appreciate your dedicated support and uh, it's gonna keep me out here for years to come so I really appreciate it so does my family and I will see y'all next time when we're off the water